Today's Fraud Friday is about personal data loss. And before we talk about how it happens, you should know that data loss costs Americans around $10 million every year. So here's what happened. Hackers had gained access to the personal information of billions of Americans. This included social security numbers, addresses of your current and past places of residence, as well as your family members' names. Now, here's what you can do. First, you can freeze your credit at the big credit bureaus. You can connect with Experian, Equifax, as well as TransUnion. When you freeze your credit, remember, it's free to do this and it will stop bad actors from taking out loans and opening up credit cards in your name. You can also protect your data and your finances by using a password manager. You can enable two-factor authentication, make sure that you're updating your devices, and be on the alert for scams. Additionally, you can check if your social security number was breached by heading to pentester.com and npdbreach.com. Let's review. At The Smarter Service, we want you to be equipped with the right tools to take action. First, you can freeze your credit by heading to Experian.com, Equifax.com, and TransUnion.com. You can also check to see if your data has been breached by heading to Pentester.com and NPDBreach.com. I recommend you lift up your phone right now and you take a picture of this screen so you could get back to it later. But if you want to learn more tips like these, reach out to us at thesmarterservice.com. We've got your back.